Okay, hey everyone, that was chapter 17, I was called Aaron Staff Buds. Lord and Moses saying, Speak to the people of Israel and get from them staffs. One for each father's house from all their chiefs, according to their father's house, the twelve staffs, right? The uh, twelve staffs of the twelve tribes of Israel. Write each man's name on the staff and write Aaron's name on the staff of the Levi, for there shall be one staff for the head of each father's house. Then you shall deposit them in the tent of meeting before the testimony where I meet with you. And the staff of the man whom I choose shall sprout. Thus I will make to cease from me the grumbling of the people of Israel, which they grumble against you. Moses spoke to the people of Israel, and all their chiefs gave them, gave them staffs, one for each chief, according to their father's house, as twelve staffs, and the staff of Aaron was among their staffs. And Moses de de uh, deposited the staffs before the Lord in, tent, in the tent of testimony. The next day Moses went to the tent of testimony, and behold, the staff of Aaron for the house of Levi had sprouted, and put forth buds, and produced blossoms. And it bore ripe almonds. And then Moses brought out all the staffs from before the Lord to all the people of Israel. And they looked, and each man took his staff. And the Lord said to Moses, Put back the staff of Aaron before the testimony to be kept as a sign for the rebels, that you may make an end of their grumblings against me, lest they die. Thus did Moses, as the Lord commanded him, so did. And the people of Israel said to Moses, Behold, we perish, we are undone. We are all we are all undone. Everyone who comes near, who comes near to the tabernacle of the Lord, shall die. Are we all to perish? So, since God's holy, no sin can come to Him. Um, if if sin does try to come to Him, He, he destroys it. The only way that sin can, the only the only way someone um, who's sinful can, can come to God through the Holy Spirit, which then convicts you of your sins and leads you to God, leads you to repent, leads you to salvation. It's the only way that we can come to God is if like I said, he sends, he sends the Holy Spirit upon you, which can then convict you of your sins, which, which then will lead you to repent and will for God. Um, you know, here in the Old Testament, uh, you know, God says, if any, if any sin comes to me, he will destroy because he's holy, he's perfect. No sin can be in God. And, it, it, and, and uh, if you call yourself a Christian, yeah, you're not living it, maybe you need to question your, your salvation. Because <laughs> a true Christian will, will love God and hate sin and will live for the Lord. So, um, like I said, like, like I just said, the only way to come to God is if God saves you, the Holy Spirit can be she resists and leads, you, and leads you to repent and live for Him. Otherwise, sin cannot come to God he's, because He's holy, He's perfect, and He will destroy sin, especially when He comes back and He returns. The 17 male Aaron staff buds. Be right back.